In this video we are going to see AC working principle. Before going to the working we see the major part in AC. Operator, condenser, expansion valve, compressor, meter. These are the major parts in AC. And the gas used in AC is ferron 12. Its a chemical name is dichloro difluoromethane. Let me go into the working. Step 1. When we on the AC, we fix the temperature in the remote. The metering in the AC start to compare the fixed temperature and the room, room temperature. The room temperature is detected by temperature detector which is placed near a operator. From meter, the output signal is given to compressor and expansion valve. Step 2. The compressor sucks the air and compresses the gas into liquid. Due to change in pressure and state, the liquid become very hot. Step 3. The hot liquid is forced to pass through condenser where the high speed fan is blown out to transfer the heat on the liquid to atmosphere. The compressor and the condenser are located outside the room. Step 4. The expansion valve is a key to make the liquid stay to gas stage. This compressor liquid is now allowed to expand now. The liquid is changed to gas stage. During this change in state, the gas becomes very cold. Step 5. This cold gas is allowed to pass through over the evaporator. In evaporator, it is designed like a radiator. And the back side of the radiator, its circulated fan is placed, which takes the air from the room and blow over the radiator. On this process, the room hot air transfer the heat to evaporator and inside the evaporator the gas get heat outside the air get cool in this process the heat transfer take place evaporator and condenser are mainly made up of copper since copper is good transfer of heat in the whole process ac is not taking outside air into inside inside hot air into cold air so ac will not produce fresh air it produce only cool air inside room if you like this video you can subscribe it and if you think it is useful for your friend you can share this video thank you for watching this video